Every child knew about the Sky River. The transcendent Emperor had buried its pieces deep. And then, this Emperor's horrific sacrifices had brought it back to the surface. Bernardo wasn't exactly sure how to use the legendary weapon. But surely, there must be some way to do it without provoking another catastrophe. Had he, somehow, summoned the long-lost components of the legendary weapon out of the deep places of the Earth? It was more than Renato could fathom. But if he could find a legendary weapon, he would use it. As he set foot on the island, Bernardo couldn't help feeling a bit curious. Was Lupino still waiting to be rescued? No. He was probably drinking champagne with the ravens. Did ravens drink champagne? Did rabbits? Bernardo felt oddly thirsty, come to think of it. Why had he chosen the Sky Ripper? Bernardo never made plans that required constant vigilance. He was a hero. He didn't think too much, he just went with his gut and hoped it all worked out. The Sky Ripper was a long shot. He'd have to devote himself to it. No side journeys, no rescuing old friends. That was against his nature. Could he stick with it? been open before that had been his mistake before Trusting his old friend Lapino, who had been through so many battles with him and shed so many heartaches, who he'd rescued so many times. What was up with that guy anyway? A very clever engineer named Elon Muspratt had got his start making floating platforms. Not many people knew that. Superman issue number one, in mint condition, in a jar he'd broken. He planned to keep breaking things until he had the whole series.
eyes have had it. couldn't figure them out. On the other hand, if there was a puzzle, it was probably meant to keep people away from something good. banana peels. There had to be more. There was. Skyripper's armature. The stuff that dreams are made of. Engineers' dreams, anyway. The device was intricate. No one alive had the skill to make a thing like it. How is it part of a weapon at all? He'd have to ask a scientist. But first, he'd get the second piece. Skyripper had a heart. A core that had come to rest on the next island. Well, there was another island he could reach. Zenobia had just invaded it with her father's raven battalions. She must be encamped there still. But fighting Zenobia now, that made no sense at all. He'd already sacrificed one friend to get this, this armature, was it? He didn't need to hurry to face her. She would find him 